Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another segment of the Bickering Gamers. No! Damn it! I didn't even tell him this time. Okay, uh, how are you? Hey, Wait, how, did we start recording? Yeah, we did. Oh, <laughs> oh, damn it! 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 Oh, damn it!
But once I saw this new information coming up, I was I'm psyched for this. The story they came up was really well thought out and really cool. The game looks incredible. Uh, I like I I like like when I a touch more cinnamon, but it's good. Oh, good. When I when I play uh, the Legend of Zelda, I always liked I always liked the combat, but the game's all about the puzzles. So I think it's a cool idea for a spinoff to uh, the flip the switch a little bit, you know. Now, I can't wait to see what kind of weapons and combinations. Now this idea of combat is it? Uh, well, the guerrilla warfare tactics is it? Uh, it could be revolutionary war it's, tactics. It depends on the person because one person they could be like me. They bomb rush the entire thing, go straight blitz through, cream. and get to the end. A blitzkrieg. Yeah. So far, we know. And depending on how good of a player you are, you can get rid of everything along the way. Right. So uh, far, we, so far we know there are uh, two. Sometimes you need to though. So far, we know only two playable characters. Uh, apparently, there's gonna be a lot of playable characters, but we know that Link's Link gonna be playable. And yeah, and, and not Sheik. And um, Impa. Well, will, and Impa you, will be playable. That's what I meant. Sheik might be. That's a good possibility, but. Um, what, 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 basically, they're the two playable characters. Link, uh, <laughs> Link showed off a couple oh, of weapons. <laughs> Link showed off a couple of weapons where he's mostly a sword, uh, sold a sword wheeler. <laughs> he has, God <laughs> damn it, man! Oh, yeah. gets I'm gonna shove a. Again I'm gonna shove a cork up your ass and shove a plug down your throat. Yeah. Good luck doing that. That's oh, I can't. I've done it to guy. I have iron jaws. Good. It'll hold it in place. If you need uh, to him open. Actually, uh, manages to uh, take his mouth shut. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh. I could pull a Godzilla on you. Eat my spit. <coughs> All right, so, um, yeah. Uh, so the weaponry uh, works pretty cool. You have a, uh, you have a sub, you don't have sub items like you do in typical Zelda fashion. I imagine I'm not familiar with the Dynasty Warriors bit, so I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna keep saying I imagine that's in Dynasty Warriors. With that, with the lack of sub weaponry, uh, but I, I, remember I know there's I magic though. A, I think you get a secondary weapon. I'm not sure. Yeah, that makes more sense. Depending on the game, right? Because mm. Link can either, I, I from what I've seen at least, Link, uh, I've seen Link with uh, a a sword where he had a shield with him as well, but he uh, and it was faster. But he also had a, a double sword, most likely the Goron sword, where, but he had with two hands with no defense, but it does a whopping deal of damage, and. There is magic abilities. Um, the fire rod was shown in, in, in some cases. Bombs are in there, which they've mentioned will be in uses other than combat. So we're guessing they can blow up walls. Yeah. And I don't, I, Sheik is supposed to be like um, a little more... Impa. I, I, damn it, Tyler. Impa, <laughs> Impa is supposed to be a little more uh, a cra like a stealthy. Of a character, she's supposed to be more like technique. At least from what I know, I, I haven't I haven't really read up on the information a lot. Well, she is basically a ninja. Well, she's a sheik, a sheik, which is basically a ninja. She's a sheikah. No, a sheik is a. Uh, it actually is one of the uh, Arabian versions of a ninja. Yeah. Again, yeah. you're proving my. You're proving what I'm saying. It's, it's not basically really a, nin a ninja. It's not really a ninja. They don't use stealth. Can we stop here, please? Can we just they all agree techniques. right now that it? Yeah. Is your is your street pass on? <laughs> So you're saying they so you're saying they use the well, chic, not. So you're saying they use the chic technique. Hey, thanks. I turn it off. <laughs> thanks. I need more troops. Uh, they use uh, the uh, chic technique. So um that's a good the idea. Chic, that's, that's I think that'd be really cool though if they bring back chic. I think that'd be an interesting idea cuz we don't know much about what's going on. Here's how the sto we know the story. Um uh, we don't know where the timeline is. We don't even know it's going to be in the timeline. I doubt it, but I would like it to be there with how cool the story is because it actually is very more adult and very cool turn for a Zelda game. It's a um, it's a love triangle story. Uh, Link is a, a trainee in the army, and somehow we're going to find out how he rose to power. Um, and Basically, I think they fa they find the Triforce on him. He pulls out yeah, the Master Sword. Yeah, pretty much. And yeah. he's just like, yeah. come at me, bitches! Yeah, that's probably how it's going to go down. But yeah, li but yeah, Link... Um, Link uh, 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 gets the attention of Sia. Now, Sia is getting a lot of controversy right now because her, her design is a lot of fucking cleavage. I'm just going to say it straight out. Every video I've seen, it's going to be like, well, she's a little more on the Team Ninja side. No, she has a big fucking rack with a lot of cleavage. I'm just going to say it straight no, out. No, literally, it's just straight down the middle of the boob. That's where the clothes it's, are. It's Street Fighter logic right there. That's her... That's her no, can you imagine a V going down from the belly button up to the shoulders... Going straight up the middle of the boob, and that's her fucking. Outfit. Yeah, but if you stop yeah, being a horny yeah. teenager, I really like. I do like her design. I I, I think it's very. Why do you think they do it? Yeah, horny and the most teenagers. and the most overplayed person in the game will you know? Yeah. Well, she's the, she's the villain. Yeah. She was once a good guy. She's actually. I have, a lot of people are thinking because of her tattoos. You can see <clears> her leg. 
she might be a Sheikah herself because, and it makes sense because she's supposed to uh, be guarding what I have no idea what the fuck it means, but I guess we'll find out. The equilibrium of the Triforce. Like apparently they had her because the Sheikahs are for those who don't know their Zelda lore are supposed to be people who guard and protect the royal family, and. Um, if she is a Sheikah, I'd really like that, if that turns out to be true, because that'd be really cool and fit her early character. And apparently this is after a war, and they want to protect the Triforce, because from Link Between Worlds, we know it's a bad idea to destroy the Triforce, because then you get a low rule. So instead, yeah. you got to try to protect it, but it looks like that's not going to work either, because somehow we don't know yet, see it turns evil... But they're saying it's because she, she probably, felt... She probably got fucked by Gandalf. No, she fell in love... But uh, for, uh, I'm sure Gandalf will be snuck in here. Like, uh, Hopefully you don't know Twilight Princess it, but I'm sure Gandalf will be snuck in somehow. Sia somehow... W what they said was she fell in love with Link. I don't think that's the full story. But she's saying that she got drove to jealousy because she uh, Link spent so much time with Zelda. And... Um, yeah, I, I don't know. We'll find out in the game. But it, it's a really cool idea because so far we're seeing a lot more like, adult theming in Zelda. And I think that's something that will be really interesting for a spin-off. Are they going to be announcing that at E3? Because I hope they Yes, are. they are. They're going to talk more about it. Well, we know in Japan yeah, it's coming out in August. So it's probably going to come out in September in the States <clears throat> and the Europe. All right. Man, you have no pieces. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I love the way you say it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, you have no pieces. It's me and Tyler are doing it's, 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 it's street pass stuff, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Honestly, I never Which have, have this on because I want to save energy. No, yeah, I know. I'm, I'm all the way up well, to once you get to, but I want to 100% complete this. You can get the uh, refurbished battery. That helps out a lot. If not, it's hey, an XL. Yeah. Hey, buddy, you have no pieces. Hey, baby, you have no tits. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. So speaking Shut of tits, up. so yeah, see ya, um... No, that was completely unprovoked. I just had to do that. Um, Tyler, go away. Too late. Boing. I hate the episode where he actually talks. Um, I, <laughs> okay, so... Hey, you invited me. And this is I'm in house. your house. <laughs> you invited no, I'm talking, me. I'm talking about into the Bitcoin Gamers. Well, we actually were the two people that... Dear... Dear Bicker past self, dear bickering game, do yourself a favor and fuck off. <laughs> yours truly, your future self. Wait, you oh, demand. Yours truly, the internet. Can I say one thing, Nick? <laughs> yes. You only have eleven people in your street pass. And now, <laughs> and now I'm going <laughs> Again, to email this to this myself, but I'm going to put my you computer's date do. manually to the future. Right. So technically, I did it, and you can all go fuck yourself. All right, which one of you <coughs> farted with moldy ass? Who do you fucking think? Who do you think? Okay, really? let's not. People don't want to listen to the listen to that. Can we please God, move on? Yes, please. Thank you. Um, so, see ya. Like I was, like I wanted to get into. Like, you know, the raging boner hard on. Like oh, I wanted to get God. into, I personally think this is the perfect idea for a spin-off Zelda game. And I actually, with the sound of the story and all the landscapes, like when you see the. The 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 uh, images the the still frames that you gave us they look great and it looks very exciting and thrilling. I really do think this is a good turn for a spinoff game. I think it's very well done. That that that's what all I have to say about that there. But yeah, the story they're giving us bits and pieces, which good because I'm sick of the internet ruining every game I I uh, I get excited for. Mm -hmm. Like Mario Kart Eight in mind because it's just a racing game, but I, I got moments where I pretty much knew what happened and. Um, in Pokemon before it even came out. Where do you think this whole yeah. game is going to go? I mean, it doesn't even sound... I mean, it sounds nice, but... You well, know, what, that's what, what I said. What do you think it's going to... What do you no, like? Come you, on. You're saying exactly what... I, what you're feeling right now, that's exactly, exactly in every way what I felt when the game was announced. That's exactly what Where's I Where's it going to go? It's just, it's just a spin-off game. I know, but what's going to be the point of it? Just for fun. Just, but we... A lot of people try to... Be a try to, do, to make a story. different take on a... Franchise. That's yeah, and that's it, the reason they're doing. Oh, so they're gonna 1984 Godzilla. Yeah, yeah, they're just but gonna. Nintendo needs to do this more often. I really, really think that. I really think Nintendo should let <laughs> other people. Like they did that with Rareware and Donkey Kong. Look how well that turned out. And I, and if this works out, I really think they should do that more often. I think that'd be really cool if they let other people uh, handle their games. Um, as long as they supervise it, Anuma, who usually yes. who, uh, who usually takes care of the Zelda games, he is supervising this game. And he does approve of all the designs and whatnot, which is why, um, which um, I forgot who it was. I was watching, I was reading on a blog. I, uh, the guy was making a point where, uh, if you notice, Impa, um, 
is much, much less, um, uh, much less, uh, what's the word? What's the word for sex? What's a sophisticated word for saying sexified? Uh, uh, Holy! Uh, Bodaciously voluptuous. No, 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 uh, well, okay. So it was a lot less sexified. Let's just go with that one. Then a lot less voluptuous than Sia is in her design. And um, a guy was making a point yeah. that you know the fact that Anuma uh, approves these designs, it shows that he doesn't want them to mess with Impa in her character. But I think this can really. I think despite a lot of people's disgust with her, with Sia's uh, uh, Sia's look and first glance. I think it's a good idea because it'll probably dis to, uh, discover her character really well. Because she gave up her good in her, she gave up her good energy. She takes all, she took in all the power of evil when because she made a deal with someone. Again, I don't know everything about the game. Thank God. <laughs> um, she teams up with a couple of guys we don't know much about yet, and they're trying to take over Hyrule. Probably trying to overthrow Zelda. You know, it's probably gonna be one of those. It's always been about you stories with Link. Um, but yeah. yeah, yeah. How you doing, Tyler? Checking on, I'm checking on my PayPal. Do you so? Oh, that, that's great. Uh, uh -huh. Would you like to tell us your uh, your email and password while you're at it? <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, come here and I'll show it to you. So this way the viewers can see. Oh, it. that's not fun. Um, I don't even want it. Let me. I don't even want it. Um, it's not crusherkey24dayold.com, and it's not. Do you suck my fucking dick? <laughs> you suck my. <laughs> Fucking. Let's not. It's F U K I N. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. With the capital F. Oh uh, yeah, I was just about to ask. Any capitals? Oh uh, boy. Can you actually believe it? So no, he's, he's trying to. He's whoever, sarcastic. whoever here exactly. has experience with Dynasty Wars, I really don't. But I'm hoping this I, gets me into it. I actually. Do you guys mind never... like catching me up to speed with this? Because I'm really interested now. I'm hoping this game gets me into the series because I want to fill up games for my... Because I want to get a PS3 and I want to fill up games Second for my library. Second you get library. a PS3, get as many of them as you can because they are fucking fun. Yeah, I'm sure. I don't... I never owned one, but every time I played one, I was literally sitting there... So this is your... This is this is what you... For you, what Jack and Daxter was for me, right? Yeah. yeah. I owned all the Jack and Daxters, but... But I'm saying, like, you never owned the games, but you had a, you you really remember them well because you played them at other people's houses. Because here's the thing: every time I played them, I played them for eight hours at a time at least. Right. And that is someone who has no. Well, I'm, I, I imagine this game. That was someone who went out every day. I'm imagining that game gives you a lot of satisfaction with all the enemies, and there's gonna be cool mid bosses. Like we saw one in the trailers where you fight the Dongo, uh, King the Dongo, which is really cool. So you know you can't wait to bomb what some about the Dongos. Moblins are like main mooks. Uh, you see them a lot. I saw them a lot in the trailers. It'll depend on where you are. We seen the with the we seen trailers around Hyrule Castle, but we but we know what uh, we seen uh, areas like a desert. We seen Nairu Desert. Uh, we seen all the places. A lot of people think uh, with, with the canon that this might be by Skyward somewhere around Skyward Sword. I see. Based on what they think. Oh my god, that's awesome. Well, you gotta remember, the timeline is something people talk about every time a Zelda game comes out, now that there's of a timeline. Of course. Yes, they're gonna try to fit. They're and, gonna try to see where this fits. Yeah, and they said it was a, they said it wasn't, a, they said it was a side all game. They can think about. They were saying it, it wasn't a side game, but they are set, but people are making the argument that doesn't mean it can't be in the timeline. I kind of agree with that, and I want to see where that goes. I don't think it's gonna happen. But in the end of the oh, day... Uh, we can just see when it is, and then we can just take it from there. It's funnier when I have my Tanuki suit on. Um, and, ah. um, uh, no, he just read my, my status on... Uh, I do, what I do on Miiverse is I wear a Tanuki suit. I don't know why it's off. And, and, I, and I have my oh, uh, status saying, come, come, say, at, come, me, come at me, PETA. Yeah, because I usually wear a Tanuki suit. And I, uh, ha and I have a dumb suit. Oh, when you suit. street pass with someone for the first time, it doesn't come up? No, he doesn't have the update. Oh, oh, I get it. Yeah, because they're suits, I get it. Oh, look, a video game. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Oh, piece of candy. That's what we're talking about. Oh, wow, that was a wow, wow. I'm a soldier boner right there. Yeah. yeah. Me, me and Jim do that all the time. So, uh, what was, there's this main attack thing they have. What's it called? Uh, they, um, they, they, were, they said in the thing that they're replacing some sort of power. Like, it's when you... Something like you charge up energy and it's like a big attack. Like you're firing your laser. Like the spin uh, attack or the down. No, in, in Dynasty Warriors. Uh, Bushu, uh, <laughs> oh, I, the the Mushu. Mushu I know what you're talking about. Yeah. yeah. Mushu Gaipan? Pan. Give me a name here. I can't remember. Mushu Gaipan? This has been four years since I played this game. But um, 
They, what's cool is they're actually. What you're talking about. What's cool is though. Um, let's just say it's basically the final smash. Yeah, but what's cool about that is they're actually thinking about that. They're actually balancing. I, I like the team who does these games because they're doing a great job of balancing how they're going to represent Zelda and how they represent their franchise. And I'm sure Anuma's helping that as well. Oh, definitely. Because um, what we see here is you have they're replacing like that attack. I'm trying to think of the name of. Just look it up on the oh, internet. No, you guys second. have Google. I'll look it up. Thank you. With um, the, the, and they're replacing that with the spin attack for Link, and um, they're going to have like some sort of like Impa's moves are basically water moves. She has a lot of water attacks. I don't understand what the connection is, but I guess we'll see. Um, and she's more based on magic, while Link's more based on uh, on force. So yeah, I'm, I'm interested where this is going. Um, I I'm wondering how many characters there are because from what I heard, Dynasty Warriors had a, a game with 77 characters at one point. So it's making me think, who else could they add? Like, if you're not going to make this a canon game and you're just going to lock okay, characters to play... Um, it's still called uh, Mus Musula, but it's different in between the two games. In uh, Warriors, Dynasty Warriors, it's called Muso Rambu. Yeah, that was also the name. And Samurai Warriors is called... Um, Mus I'm, in, I'm not going to pronounce it, but it's... It's spelled differently at the end. It's called the Arbon, o, U o U G I. I'm not gonna put you the name anymore. Fair enough. All right, that yeah, that's what I was thinking of the Mushu thing. You know the Mushu. Mushu Rambu yeah, Mushu. Thing, you know Eddie Murphy. And Sam yeah. was okay. Mushu, uh, from now on, what about Mushu? I believe that's how they pronounce it. You mean huh. Mushu right. got him with a side of pork fried ice? From now on, from now on, <laughs> I'm going to call yesterday. the Mushu attack the Eddie Murphy move when I when I get a Dynasty Warriors game. Whenever I will kill you. Go. God damn it! Now imagine Eddie Murphy Matt releasing like, 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 no, no, even better. I'll imagine Donkey from Shrek, just like, Donkey. just like summoning dragon, fucking like throwing <laughs> shit. Mushu guy pen with a side of poor fly lights. Donkey, trust oh, yeah, me. Tyler. If it was me, you'd be dead. Yeah. Yeah. You'd be Tyler. dead. What's up? You know the only one character in the Dynasty Warriors that uses katana, right? Zaltai, he's the only character in Dynasty Warriors that's as, that weaves a katana and has the same fighting style as some of the samurais used to have. So with all those, wow. so with all those playable characters, do you ever get like a connection to these guys? Is like like a main person you have to follow, or how does that work? Do you unlock the characters as you go? Yeah, you unlock the characters as you, you go. You unlock them as you progress you through the story. The I, I actually, equipment. my habits with Dynasty Warriors is I play the other modes where I touch the story mode because I want to go through all the characters and take a look at all the oh all their. Um, so they have a different perspective. Yeah. yeah, like if there's like five characters and you play the story five times with different characters, it's different cutscenes or how does that work? Yeah, they have very That's different cool. cutscenes for each character. Like, if you play nice. as Cell Cell, you'd be seeing it from his perspective. If you play as Cell Tie, you get to put, see from his perspective. If, you're not too, if you don't want to start the story yet, you can play, uh, like, in, in the Dynasty Warriors 8, the combined uh, conquest and uh, castle building thing from 7 right. into the vision mode. And now they have the rage meter, they have the new um, counter attack. The so, cool. it's like, the so, it's like you have... Um, it's like when you meet the characters and you lock them. Is it justified in the story? That's what I'm wondering because I really want to know that for the legend of, for the for when Hyrule Warriors comes out because I want to see what kind of characters they can get. Like uh, in Game Explain, um, they found in an analysis they found a blue-haired person in the corner of the screen, and a lot of people think that's Nairu in her sage form. I hope so. With, it might be possible. Yeah, it make, yeah, so playing as the yeah. sage as the goddesses in their sage form. I think that makes perfect sense, but that would be really, yeah, it might really be cool. Hard that would make a lot of the sense. Rage bar from Dynasty Warriors Eight, because in Dynasty Warriors Eight, if you go to Rage Bar and use a Bushu attack, that's different from the regular one. Right. So, and if you get like a couple, you can take out a whole group of peons. You get some bonuses from them. Yeah, that's really cool. And you know what? It's, it's a series like this that I, I it's just so perfect. Like the more I hear about this, the more perfect it is to make a Zelda spin of this. And I don't know. Are there any, was there any sequels to Samurai Wars or the, any of the spinoffs they made? Yeah, uh, the latest one is Samurai Warriors Three, and the oh. only localized version we get was on the Wii. Ah, okay. And there's also Dynasty Warriors Gundam. Yeah, Dynasty I know the Warriors Gundam. Gundam. I know about the Gundam one. The new one's coming out in, in the summer. Gundam, Dynasty Warriors Reborn. Oh yeah, Dynasty I was thinking. I'm sorry. Gundam Reborn. Sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. I have to recant what I said before. I said there was a Metal Gear. I was thinking of Gundam. Sorry. Ah, uh, it's okay. <laughs> 
Yeah. Blah, blah. I just don't want the commenter. Yeah, it's a piece of candy. The, 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 that, that, that one Herbie commenter just started tried to erase his comment before we saw it because he clearly commented that before I said it and didn't wait until the end of the video to make a recant. Yeah. Don't you hate those people? Yeah. I, yes, like, I do. Like, we've yeah. all been guilty of doing it at least a couple of times, but I hate the people who do it and know they do it. Like, they just won't stop. You know what I mean? Yeah. YouTube problems, man. The YouTube problems. But yeah. Or nerds. So, I think this is an instant day one buy for me. Uh, I don't know about you guys. What do you think? Not me. Me. Well, I didn't think this would be you, you kind Probably of thing. Probably me. If but they Greg, do a PC port like Dynasty Warriors, like uh, how I got Dynasty Warriors Extreme Legends, uh, collected, uh, edition with PCs, if they do Extreme yeah. Legends uh, for the Hyrule Warriors, really? then I'll get it on Steam. Am I now? Oh, yeah, I should try yes. out Steam. It's good to do. Yep. I, think I, might, I think I just got Triple yeah, M. Yeah, uh, Dynasty Warriors. Uh, <clears throat> well, I, I never see you as much of a Zelda fan in general. I, I was I was okay. I, I listen. I was a Zelda fan, yeah. not a big fan. I, you know, no, I get it. You know, you're just yeah, not. I wasn't that big it's of not a Zelda that fan big. It's not like, that big a cup of your uh, a cup of tea for you, right? Like, like, games, like you wouldn't like, like, like you wouldn't. You're not against it, but you're not for it. Yeah. Yeah, I wasn't a big well, fan of Zelda until game. Link to the Past. So a lot of people. That was a lot of people's story. Zelda, the Zelda games are like the type of broads where you know. It's like I do them, but you know, it's like it's you like know, you don't. Know, it's you, like you nail and it's bail. Like, it's like you, know? you won't for, you won't regret it when they when they leave the bar. Yeah, it's like yeah. nailing it's like, and bailing. Yeah. You know? I, I I I dig that. I dig them. What you're saying. Yeah. I mick that and he dig dag dog dog dig dag dog. That's just my thing now. I'm saying I I mick dag and he dig dag dog dig dog dig dog. Then sometimes I go. Shadow Draco. Maybe you can enlighten me on something. What's up? What is Mushu? I never ate it. Huh? What is Mushu? That's a food. I never ate it, yeah. Yeah. Mushu? Yeah. I thought it was just a red dragon from Mulan. It's a food. Oh. So the red dragon from Mulan is named after a food? Yeah. Huh. Wow. You know, that poor pork. fuck. You know Mushu pork? No, uh, I get it what now. What is Mushu? I get it now. He's supposed to... I get it now. He's small and you can sure, eat man. him I, easily. I like get it now. Before, I'm not too sure. I don't think that's what they were getting at, but... Okay. It's a metaphor. It's it symbolic. In Dynasty you know? Warriors, this basically means special attack. Uh, and they get the true one, and then that's the strongest one you can get in game. Boss. In Dynasty Warriors 8, they actually improved the free, the free um, Mushu attack you get. <laughs> So yeah, in the end, great job. Can't wait to see how this is gonna come out. Uh, I like what I'm hearing with the, what they do with their normal franchise, and yeah. the fact that Zelda is gonna probably put them on the map, especially for Nintendo, which will greatly broaden their audience. We got a, we got uh, something good going on. Yeah. So, uh, hey, so we're, at, we're out of time. So see you thank you all for watching. See you, V Gabbers, Narrow Maniacs, Darklings, SD cards that Shadow Dracos. Uh, oh, you've been thinking about you've been thinking yeah. about some bad <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, uh, see right, you, Dragon Fisters, and see you, Military Mook Maggots. Out. Remember, don't oh, actually fist a dragon. They don't like that. I, I, oh my I, god. I hate Dragon <laughs> Fisters. What am I called again? What Wait. are they called? Narrow Maniacs. Narrow Maniacs. That actually is nice. Okay. Bye, Darklings. Okay.